Content at scale. This is how you install the WordPress plugin and then how you use it or the main feature of it, which is to write the blog in content at scale and then automatically upload it into your WordPress website. If you've not heard of content at scale, I'm raving about it. Uh, yesterday, slightly clickbaity title in my thumbnail where I said it smashes Jasper. But basically, there's a link in the description. I've put in a link in the description of this video. It's a free trial. You can test it out for yourself. It writes for blog articles. Here is the killer selling point of content at scale for blog articles that Google or anybody cannot detect have not been written by a human. All right. Yes, I know. And very impressive. So and I'm going to be making another video later today of writing another full blog with it. That's going to be a little bit less informal than the first one I did. But here is how you install the plugin. Let's go. So uh, here is content at scale. So you just simply uh, go over to once you've done it. So I've put the link in the description. You'll get some free credits here. Each credit means you can write a full blog. All right. So uh, you might not get nine, uh, but you'll get a couple to try it out. Uh, now, here we go. Simply download the WordPress plugin and download. And once that is downloaded, I've already downloaded it, so I'll go to the next step straight away. You just simply go, obviously, to your WordPress site. Where are we? And you simply add in, just like you would normally do, plugins and add new plugin. And you upload. So I'll just show you quickly. This is, I don't really need to show you this, do I know? So you go to add new plugin, upload plugin at the top, and upload the zip file that is called content machine. All right. Once that is installed, you will see it down here, Content Machine, and I've already done it, but when you open Content Machine for the first time, it won't be connected. It will say, please insert the API key. So you go back to Content at Scale, and on your project, so this will link the project. So basically, the project is the website. Uh, you will click Connect WP, and this is going to bring up my API key, which I'll have to blur out in this video. Connect and it brings up your API key, which you then copy and you will paste it into your WordPress site. And then once you've done that, I'm not installing it. You can do it yourselves. <laughs> once you've done that, it'll then show you this and it'll say that it is automated. OK, once it's connected, this is the main thing. So it does do auto links and it does do short codes, but we're not going to worry about that. When you go back to content at scale, then. And you've got your article and you click on this is the article I created yesterday using a content at scale. OK, so as I say, it, just just quickly, if we look through this, yeah, to get in the top 10, I've got a few too many words here and a few too many headings. So maybe to get in the top 10 in the future, I want a shorter article. But that was the article I created. I've actually already put it in using HTML. So forget that. Uh, what you actually do is you choose, it's linked to your blog, so you choose the category you want it to appear in your website, and then you schedule it to appear at a certain time, and it will automatically post it from the content at scale dashboard into your WordPress site. And that's it, really. Um, as I say, do try it out. There's a link that I've put in the description of this video. Uh, it's basically going to give you a couple of free trials, tickets, sorry, blogs, uh, to create and then once you do if you do subscribe through that link you'll get 20 percent off all right any subscription you take up so uh try it out and uh yeah there you go that is how you install the wordpress plugin for content at scale try it out it's really exciting